Appreciate y'all. I'll let y'all next time. Black and white can make it more official. Lord, forgive me, cause I know that I'm a sinner. Yeah, they call me champion, say to say that on that nigga. Only time see the contender when I'm looking in the mirror. Sitting at the table with a circle full of winners. Think my chick look good, now I hope she see me in her. Way that I be flossing just to see you wait on my man. What's going on, y'all? Today's video is going to be about getting fuel. So, I told y'all we're going to do a video about how to get fuel at the um, truck stop. So, for all y'all new drivers um, trying to get into the business, stay tuned, watch the video, and um, like and share. So, let me go on and um, get y'all set. You see my fuel hand is at a quarter of a tank. You usually want to get fuel when it reaches a quarter of a tank. Sometimes I'll do it at half a tank. If I was over the road, I'd probably do it at half a tank. But um, you never want to let it get to that red line because you never know how far you got to go to your next fuel stop. You see, I need some depth fuel too. So I'm going to get all that and I'm going to show y'all how to um, get some depth fuel. So turn the truck off and get y'all outside. <laughs> Getting in the truck and man, you know, keeping up with my videos. And um, uh, had any questions about just you know getting gas? You always want to pull all the way up, like you're going into the opposite or the fuel island next to it, so your trailer will line up in the fuel island you're trying to get to. If that makes sense. Yeah, man, let's get this gas, man. But it's fuel, we can't say gas. Let's get this fuel. Oh, so we're gonna try this again. See, I already took my gas cap off. So we're gonna try this again. So, when you pull up to the fuel island, take out your company car, you insert it, like so, you take it out, give it a little time to read, I'm just gonna ask you some questions, uh, no, you ain't got no, I ain't got no cars, so I'm gonna skip it, so I'm gonna ask you if you're getting tractor, reefer, or both, I'm just getting tractor, so I'm gonna click tractor, I'm just gonna ask you, do you want Delph, if you don't want it, don't get it, if you do, then you're gonna need it. 
vehicle ID number, my truck number. Just type that in, 77747, enter. Don't ask you, do you want to watch or whatnot? No, don't want that. Any additional products? Nah, I'll never get that. I'm asking for a drive, your driver ID. Type in my driver ID. You press enter. And you wait. Authorizing. Once it says authorizing, you're good to go. And it says remove nozzle. Pick up your handle, lift it up. And sometimes you want to hold this thing because if it goes back down, then you gotta wait another hour or so to fuel up. So I'm gonna click it. We got it going now. So I'm gonna walk over here and get my passenger on tank. Now the thing is, um, you wanna fill up. You wanna fill up the passenger tank first. Always make sure that one's topped off first. Always, always make sure the passenger side is topped off first because if you cut the driver's side off, it cuts both sides off. So always make sure this tank is filled up first and then, you know what I'm saying, you're good to go. Yeah. And with the death fuel, with the death fuel at the truck stop, once you get finished fueling with diesel fuel, it automatically switch to the depth. So you can just, um, you ain't gotta put in no card or nothing like that. It's automatically gonna switch once you hang up the um, fuel hoses and then you can uh, add your depth, you know? So it's simple, man. And you can wash the windshield. I think that's what I'm gonna do. But they ain't got no buckets. They ain't got no buckets out here with no uh, handle. Oh, there you go. They ain't got no water in there though. So I was gonna clean my windshield up and make sure my mirrors were clean, but they ain't got no water out here, folks. That's all you gotta do, man. And um, it's, it's a simple process. You just wanna make sure you keep that lever up. The, some truck stop, that thing will go up and then come back down and then, you know, lost your opportunity to fuel up, you know, for a good hour. To, um, they open your fuel card up again. But if you are at an emergency and you need to um, make an emergency stop, uh, I think some companies, a lot of companies, they'll open up a fuel card at certain um, gas stations that's close by. But you all you always want to make sure you fueling at a gas station or a fuel station in your company's network, you know. That's the best, that's the best way I can put it. I was pretty, I was pretty empty, so it's gonna take about maybe $300 to um, fill this thing up. And then you wanna just go over and do a little pre-trip and just check, check the over, check your line. Make sure ain't nothing rubbing, touching, check your tires. Sometimes you might need air in your tires, man, and um, it's the time to do it. My tires are pretty good, man. I, I ain't going that far, just North Georgia. You see that thing drinking, man, it's still going. Look like it's gonna be four, look like it's gonna be 400, so keep on going, man, keep on going. I'm gonna go over here and um, go over and check this on passenger side out, man. You always want to make sure that passenger side good. So you're not, you're not stop now, so I'm gonna go ahead and top it off. And then hang it up.
But now I can worry about my driver's side. Always, always fill up that passenger side first, man. Can't stress it enough. You'll end up hanging up this hole and the all of it gone. So now it's no stop. $424.22. Yeah, man, she, she was thirsty. But I'm gonna top off just a little bit more. Just to be on the safe side. I probably won't have to feel for the next for the rest of the week. And now it says remove nozzle. It's talking about this delf, this delf one right here. Right there, so. grab it and then you want to click that button right there now you're ready to put your death fuel in sometimes you got a cool on that thing man it's like playing tug of war with the death fuel that death hose they got that retractable thing in there and sometimes that thing be stuck or it don't want to retract or, or whatever. So you have to really pull that thing. So this is how you get deaf for the man. And normally it don't take but like 15 to 20 dollars to fill it up if you own E. Well um, yeah, once we get finished with this, I'm gonna go in there and grab me some breakfast. And um, we're gonna head on out. So um, if y'all like this video, man, y'all rock with me, go ahead and hit that like button. Hopefully it'll get out there and uh, help somebody. But um, I know a lot of y'all know how to get fuel. Lord, I know a lot of y'all probably don't know how to get fuel or just got questions about how we get fuel. So that's how we get fuel and death fuel for these big diesel trucks. So, do me a favor, hit that like button, man. The more y'all hit that like button, the more my videos you get out there to help somebody. And I appreciate, I appreciate everybody who, you know what I'm saying, rock and subscribe and hit that like button, man. I'm just out here trying to get it. You see, it's still going. It's almost $25. And sometimes that thing don't click, so you gotta make sure yeah, sometimes that thing don't cut off, so you gotta make sure you ain't overflowing and it's stuff coming out. But I just heard, I just heard it click, so, so I'ma hang it up. Yeah, sometimes that thing don't click. And you'll have them fuel going everywhere, man. That's what you don't want. And please wear gloves. Please wear gloves with everything you do. Make sure your gas hand, your gas cap is tight, everything is good. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab me something to eat, man. And I'm gonna holler at y'all boy later, man. I appreciate y'all for watching. Just a little quick video on how to get fuel. And um i right, see y'all boys on the next video. Go ahead and hit that like button. Help me get out there. And subscribe to the channel, man. Appreciate y'all. I'll let y'all next time. Black and white can make it more official. Lord, forgive me, cause I know that I'm a sinner. Yeah, they call me champion. Say to say that on that nigga. Only time see the contender when I'm looking in the mirror. Sitting at the table with a circle full of winners. Think my chick look good, now I you should see me in her. Way that I be flossing just to see you wait on my and the life I 